Are you a minor considering emancipation? It's a big decision and a complex legal process, but we're here to guide you through it. Emancipation means becoming legally independent from your parents or guardians. Once you're emancipated, you're responsible for everything in your life, housing, food, medical care, and more. But even as an emancipated minor, you'll still need to follow certain laws, like attending school until you graduate high school. So, how do you get emancipated? Here's a quick breakdown of the steps. 1. Petition. Your parents or guardians need to file a formal request with the court. This can often be done online or in person. 2. Notification. Both parents must be notified before a court hearing can take place. 3. The court hearing. A judge will review your case and assess whether emancipation is truly in your best interest. Courts take this very seriously, they don't grant emancipation without a solid reason. 4. Declaration of Emancipation. If the judge approves your petition, you'll receive a legal document declaring you emancipated. But it's important to know, fewer than 10,000 minors are emancipated nationwide each year. The process isn't easy, and the rules vary depending on where you live. In most states, minors must be at least 14 years old to file for emancipation, but some states set the minimum age at 16. And in places like Wisconsin, emancipation isn't allowed at all unless you marry or join the military. The benefits? Emancipation gives you more freedom to make decisions about your life, like signing contracts or managing your finances. But even after you're emancipated, you'll still face restrictions, you can't drink until you're 21, buy tobacco products if you're under 18, or get married without consent in some states. However, with freedom comes great responsibility. Living on your own means handling everything from bills to medical care without the safety net of parental support. Many adults find these responsibilities challenging, so it's important to consider whether you're ready for the weight that comes with emancipation. So, should you get emancipated? It can seem like the right choice if you're facing problems at home, but it doesn't give you full adult rights, and it can place more pressure on you. The best way to decide is by consulting with an experienced emancipation attorney who can explain the process and what it means for your future. At O'Flaherty Law, we specialize in guiding minors through the emancipation process, helping you make informed decisions and navigate the legal steps. Reach out to us for a consultation at 630-757-8007, and we'll be happy to help you figure out if emancipation is the right path for you. Taking the first step toward independence is a big decision, make sure you're equipped with the right legal support to guide you through it. Contact us today.